Bonjour, professeur Fatem Zahra Ben Marakshi, donc professeur à l'ICI, School of Intelligence de l'UM6P. Euh, je pense que les masters qu'on va présenter are 100% in English, so yeah. we're going to switch to English. And the first question would be, can you like describe the general vision of the School of Intelligence before going through all the programs and... Uh, Okay. Uh, thank you. Thank you for the introduction. Yes, I'm uh, Fnum Zerban Marakshi, professor at the School of Collective Intelligence. I'm happy to be here today to present the school and the master program to our potential candidates. So the first question with uh, like, wh what is the School of Collective Intelligence? The School of Collective Intelligence was founded in June 2019, and it's de dedicated to education, research, innovation, and the social impact, and of course, in the field of, uh, of collective intelligence. And the school, well, it offers two, uh, different programs, like the PhD programs and the master program. But for now, we'll talk just about the master program. So yeah, the master program it's the first uh, it's the first master in the world accredited accredited master in collective intelligence. Well, it's focused on an interdisciplinary approach and the practical uh, project. It means that bring uh, real challenging projects into practice. Mm -hmm. So the school has um, a team or an interdisciplinary team. We are researcher and uh, scientists from different uh, disciplines, mm -hmm. uh, such as computer science, uh, data science, mm -hmm. uh, cognitive and social science, and also economics. Uh, and the, the, the Master of Collective Intelligence focuses particularly on how to implement or how to uh, explore and study collective intelligence in various uh, disciplines, as I mentioned. Um, just to know that, or uh, I, I, I think that for now, the, the potential candidates will be curious about to know what is collective in exactly. intelligence this anyway. This was the yeah. question I was going to yeah. ask you because I've, I've been very interested in, the, okay. in that matter. So I, I, I just need you to explain to uh, our viewers uh, how can collective intelligence you know, uh, intervene in their daily professional lives and how what, what it can yeah, bring Yeah, absolutely. Them. So the collective intelligence is actually a scientific discipline mm -hmm. that tends to study how a group of people uh, collaborate and work together. And uh, I just want to let you know that Collective intelligence, it's not something new. It's mm -hmm. age old. So we've mm -hmm. been used to, to collaborate and to work since ever. But now with the, 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 the technology mm -hmm. and you know that we can uh, explore uh, and study collective intelligence in a, in more sophisticated ways. Mm -hmm. Like we can uh, measure the, the effectiveness of uh, collective intelligence group using like technology yes. and advances in AI and so on. Uh, so, um, yeah, just to sum up, uh, collective intelligence, it's the ability of a group to work together mm -hmm. to solve complex problem. And it can be either in learning, okay. problem solving, or uh, uh, decision making. Okay. okay. Yeah. And so, relating back to the topic and the points you just made, um, how does the Masters in Collective Intelligence integrate practical applications and concrete projects to enrich the students' overall learning experience? Okay, so before I will answer this question, just um, I give uh, uh, the, the, or inter introduce the main track of the master. The master program in collective intelligence has three main tracks. Okay. The first one, it is behavioral and cognitive science. Mm -hmm. Second one, machine learning or computer science and data science. And the third one, leadership. So the first one focus on um, on how groups uh, work together, like uh, from an uh, individual uh, level and and the group level. Then there are gonna be uh, classes in cognitive science, experimental methods that all uh, tr try to tend to to study and explore collective intelligence in in um, social sciences uh, okay. particularly. And the second track, which is machine learning, or oh, sorry, I keep saying that mm -hmm. no, it's, um, it's uh, social or social computing or computer mm -hmm. science and data science. Well, here, here students learn how to study uh, collective intelligence using uh, so using uh, computers or using 
the advanced in AI because they will also have the chance to learn uh, more advanced courses like uh, machine learning techniques, okay. uh, uh, like uh, neural um, or um, uh, the uh, NLP and the yeah. and the neural. Uh, 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 Oh, sorry. <laughs> I, I got you. Man. Yeah. yeah. We, we yes. want to talk yeah. about it. And yeah, it is the convolution neural networks and so on. Yeah. So yeah, this is the, the about the, the 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 second track. But the last track, which is leadership, here students will uh, will study how to lead. Uh, uh, groups and to facilitate facilitate the change uh, change and also how how to make a, a group of people take better decision. Mm -hmm. So these are over you about the the the, the tracks and uh, to uh, get back to your question about how we how our master program incorporates the practical application mm -hmm. and. Um, real world application it's through the use of active pedagogical approaches that we are adopting in our classes with our students like we're in in the master program uh, for instance there is the the, the um, collaborative learning and the, the uh, ba projects based mm -hmm. learning where tr well well students work on a real world okay. projects addressing real challenges in the world so the okay. idea is that like if i understand it well you have a, a part that is very um, uh, focused on methodology and theory the other one is uh, how to facilitate so the, mm. and uh, third one with the technology yes uh, it's kind of a combination between okay. the, these okay. tracks and then and then we have different projects um, the students are working on yeah of course uh, good um and uh, thank you that you mentioned that because at the, the last uh, in the second year semester four where the internship students go under a six month period internship mm -hmm. where mm -hmm. they do their internships and you know that here they can work on different topics and chance you to apply the collective intelligence and use the tools that they have learned in mm -hmm. this two uh, years and so please we would like to know how does your master's in collective intelligence program differ from other programs? Like what sets you apart from other uh, similar programs? Uh, okay, yeah, this is a very good question. Uh, you know that uh, we always say that our master is unique mm -hmm. and, and this is because it's um, interdisciplinary uh, uh, approach. Yeah. Because you know, not, it's not only the students uh, that they have different backgrounds, but also the researcher and the faculty members who teach in the master program, they have different background. Then students will, will acquire knowledge and try to to, uh, to apply different uh, skills based on these these courses that they have learned during t these these uh, uh, two years. And another tr another uh, thing is that the the practical orientation because. Re, uh, students will work on practical projects that really address address sorry a real uh, uh, problem the challenges that we face in our daily life. Okay. How can we enter the? The master's program. Okay, yeah. So, um, given the interdisciplinary approach of our school, we are open uh, to candidates to have that they hold a bachelor in different disciplines. Like they can have, like it, it's possible that you can have a bachelor in 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 physics, computer science, cognitive science, or so social science, or an equivalent. So, but the the that but we really uh, recommend or if they have. Uh, quantitative skills like uh, coding and mm -hmm. and uh, and the statistics, they are very welcome to join this. School. So this is the strength of this of this masters. I think mm -hmm. the the world collective takes life through the fact that mm -hmm. uh, anybody uh, could somehow yes, you know, yes. uh, enter it and be able to facilitate more complex problems and very very interesting. Yes, and yeah, so uh, yeah, uh, um, I just want to say that. In the school of collective intelligence, we believe that collective intelligence has like um, is very powerful mm -hmm. because it tries to uh, to uh, solve complex pro uh, problem. And our master program reflects this belief by 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 the design of the curriculum that we have right mm -hmm. now that try to uh, to encourage students to work on real world mm -hmm. projects. Mm -hmm. And then we have the hope that they will uh, help the community. Definitely. Thank yeah. you very much. Thank you, Professor, for being here, for accepting the invitation. It was a real pleasure.